Hmm, that's interesting. I've never had that before. Um, okay, <laughs> hello there. <laughs> hello and welcome to the first ever FFUK isolation sports quiz. Uh, and thank you for joining us. Um, yeah, it's um, uh, well, it's the first ever uh, isolation sports quiz, the first sports quiz, the first quiz we've ever done on uh, on a video. Uh, but these are strange times, and therefore we must do uh, these sort of things. So um, yeah, so we thought we'd uh, do a sports quiz, and Bakes um, and Peter with me um, to do that. Uh, but this video is going to be a little bit different to what we've done before. Um, so the first thing, um, it, yeah, basically it's going to be epic. Um, if it goes right, um, which I'm sure it will. Uh, and if it doesn't go right, maybe it'll be epic as well. Um, but uh, we've got a few minutes before we start. Uh, but the first thing um, is you kind of need to get a setup really where you've got this video on YouTube, on your TV, ideally, or on a tablet. Uh, and then you're going to have your phone, uh, which is going to have, you're going to need to download the Kahoot app. Uh, and you can find that in your Play Store or your Apple Store uh, or what other store you go to, uh, you can find that. Um, yeah, and so uh, I can see we've got a few people with us, uh, five or six so far. So, um, and we've got a few nice comments coming in, so that's all good. But don't worry, we're not going to start the quiz immediately. Uh, so you've all got time to get set up and get your uh, get your uh, app sorted. Uh, so I think I'd better introduce who I've got. Oh no, I've got one more thing I need to tell people. One more thing. Uh, and that is, if you are at home with your family um, uh, at the moment, uh, which obviously some of you are, or, you know, uh, partner, whatever, whoever you're at home with, can you all just play as one team to a household? Uh, and that is because we've got a participation limit of 20 teams uh, per quiz, um, uh, or quiz round. And to make it fairest, uh, we just have to ask that uh, if there's three or four of you, playing uh, you just have to play as one team and i've seen some of the questions they're pretty tricky so if you're in a quiz if you're in a team you might have a bit of a better chance of beating pete so uh speaking of peter uh, i suppose i suppose I'd, I'd better introduce you now um anyway since i told him that everyone's been trying to beat him he's been studying really hard for this quiz um, that's true hello, peter. how are you hi how are you chris doing? yeah i'm doing very well thanks i'm taking uh Lockdown is an opportunity to increase my learning, to reflect and to uh, to plan for the future, basically. So um, it's nice to have a, a quiz to to punctuate this. Um, I've watched um, a bit of Pointless today, um, so I'm feeling ready to go. Um, got a couple of good answers. Um, yeah. OK. So I... So for the last few days, uh, I've heard that you've been knee deep in books and yes. I've also heard a rumour that you've read every book of facts there is. Hmm. So I know you're raring to go and you're chomping at the bit. Let's see how ready you, how ready you are. I'm going to ask you to tell me a fact, Pete. OK, uh, even better, actually, I'm going to give you a category. I'm going to give you a, tell me a fact about about birds. Actually, oh. hold on. No, 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 no. Birds is too easy. I need to specify. Give me a fact about partridges. Oh, wow. Um, huh. um, can I not just do a general one about birds, or do you really want a partridge fact? I'd like a partridge fact, please. The viewers would like a partridge fact. Uh, okay. Oh, um, well, um, I'll tell you this one, actually. Um, partridges are actually a, a ground-nesting bird. So it's very unlikely that you would see one in a tree, let alone a pear tree. Ah, I know a song about that. Yeah, good. Mm. OK, well, that is fantastic. And I think that's the sort of knowledge that will be completely useless in this quiz because <laughs> yes. this, this is the sports quiz. 100% sports, every yes. round, sports questions. There's, it's predominantly football, isn't it, Bakes? It is mostly football, yeah. It is yeah, mostly football, but we've we've called it a sports quiz because there are a few other questions as well thrown in. Uh, so uh, yeah, so that's um, that's you done, Pete. Uh, I better I better okay. put a hand right now. I better uh, pass on to, to Mr. Baker, who's kindly joined us. Uh, he's the master of these sort of things. Um, Evening, Chris. When we, 
when we said about a quiz, you were the man to come to. And uh, yeah, you, you've you've you're going to do things with uh, shared screens that people won't believe. Yeah, right. And and I don't know. I don't know if we're setting ourselves up for a for a fall here, Chris. To be perfectly honest, because we're massively overcomplicating it. But I'm hoping it's going to be fun. Um, I've used Kahoot quite a bit at work and doing quizzes with families and things like that. So it's good fun. Hopefully it all works. Hopefully everybody gets it to work. Um, yeah, and it isn't just one, one massive fail. Um, shall I go ahead and sort of introduce how the quiz is? Yeah, going? if you can, can you tell people basically at home, yeah, how it's going to work? And when you're ready, we'll share the screen and we'll, 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 we'll get on with it at that point. But yeah. Brilliant. Right. So, yeah, as Chris was saying at the outset, if you've got the, um, the you've got YouTube open on, on your TV or a tablet or on your laptop or something like that, you'll need that to be able to see the questions from the quiz. Uh, then what you'll need is the Kahoot app on your on your phone or tablet or something like that on a separate device. And on that separate device is where you will answer the questions. So as the questions come through, each there'll be four rounds, each of 10 questions. Um, you'll see, as I say, you'll see the questions on the screen and they're all multiple choice. I think with the exception of one question, they're all um, you have four uh, options um, for answers for each question. You'll get four colored buttons on your phone and then you just press. You'll see the question comes up and they'll be the, the, a bit like who wants to be a millionaire, four possible answers. Um, and they all have a different color. So you then you just press the corresponding color on your phone. When you see it, it'll 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 all make sense, I promise um been working on the questions for a little while for a couple of weeks um and what i've done is uh the, certainly the first three rounds which are the rounds that i've um concocted the questions for they're going to get harder as they go so that's my my little sort of uh, word of warning first round it's going to be it's going to be a little bit tricky but by round three goodness me they're they're pretty tough questions Fourth round is uh has been um curated by our guest uh guest curator so chris has very kindly put together a round as well so that'll be round four so we have four rounds of 10 questions as chris said uh each of the round it's it's, it's all sports uh it's a mixture of uh football and other sports so you'll see some questions are based on the premier league some are based on fantasy premier league these should be pretty obvious from the questions as they come through uh, general football, English football, sort of non-Premier League football. Um, through the middle, you'll see there's a, a brief hiatus into a non non-football question. So I think there's a there's like a general sport question, an Olympics question, and an American sports question. But don't worry, we get straight back into the football after that. Um, I think that's probably everything people need to know. Is that right for now, Chris? Can you think of anything else? Yeah, to sorry, I'm just just. Just Pete making a lot of noise, move, moving really his sorry. entire right. lounge around. Uh, just because he knows how it's going to work. You shouldn't be trying to put off the other competitors, Pete. Oh, well, I want to say how, um, how people should join. So in a minute, we'll we'll go live with um, uh, my screen where I'll um, yeah. broadcast the questions from. Um, if you have a look at your Kahoot app, you'll see at the bottom there's a, there's a big button that says Game Pin. So uh, as we go into the quiz a pin will appear it'll be six or seven digits long you enter in that pin and then you'll let then you'll be entered into the quiz now we, we've got a maximum of 20 players and it is it's first come first serve <laughs> I, I is. I tell you, uh, we've got nine 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 viewers at the moment nine so, viewers right. so uh, yeah so it might go up so maybe right my previous rule about uh, if you're in a household uh, everyone can can play you know i don't i don't mind um so, uh, but they, they are tough sports questions so if you want to be in a team it might make more sense it's your choice uh we'll see on the uh on the leaderboards it will come up uh, i'm thinking in particular of james pace chat and i know his boys are watching uh if you want to play on your own boys then you go for it or if you want to play as a team then you do that as a team uh we've obviously got the, the number of places now so that's great um okay so let's firstly let's share the screen so i think that's gonna then give people a bit of an idea how this more is going to work. Uh, so we're still going to be here on the side, uh, talking you through it all. Uh, Pete's going to be playing along. Paul's going to be asking the questions. Uh, but on the screen, the predominant, the, the, the major part of the screen, uh, you can see exactly uh, how it's going to work. Because in a minute, that uh, once Paul presses go, uh, we're going to get the code up and, yeah, we're going to get going. But I just want to give a couple of minutes for people to get 
get ready uh if anyone's not quite ready yet or if anyone's yet to log in uh, they're about to log in because i thought we might get more than eight people but there you go okay uh james is saying he's going to go as a team probably uh a good shout um so um right okay uh sh paul should we should we get going uh, anything else you think they need to know or I don't think so. No, I mean, you can see up here, it's FFUK number one. So we're going to go through um, the four different rounds, 20 players. You'll see the pin, enter in the pin. Then you'll see the screen and we'll see all the different um, players' names as they're joining. I would say you'll be asked to put in a nickname um, in terms of what your, your your sort of quiz name is. It'd be great if you could put something in there that we'll know will identify you, um, whether it's your, your fancy football team name or your nick, your own nickname or something like that. So, so we can... Uh, well, oh, your name, your yeah, name, would, your name would be good, really. Yeah, some somebody that you know, <laughs> yeah. to identify you basically. Um, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Otherwise, if you if we get, uh, you know, uh, big ones, nineteen seventy six or whatever, we're not we're not going to know who that <laughs> is. So. Um, I'll say as yeah, well, so, it's, there'll, be, there'll be ten questions, and it is points. So you know, each person as you as you answer the questions, you will be getting points. And it's not just about whether you get it right or wrong. It is about the speed with which you get it right or wrong as well. The faster you answer, if you're correct, then the more points you get. So if you do know the answer, try and uh, try and try and get your answer in as fast as you can because you will get more points that way. And as each question goes by, we'll get an update on the leaderboard as well, so we can see who's winning at any at any given moment. Um, so we have yeah. To so it's likely to get very, very exciting uh, at some point. Um, don't don't I'm, set I'm, this up too much, Chris. <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> no, this is good. This is good because this is like this is like a practice. If we get this one and we nail it, which I'm sure you will, then we can do a few more of these and they can be fun because yeah. we all need stuff to look forward to at the moment. And, you know, I, I, I personally quite enjoy doing these. I'm sure you guys do as well. So um, it'd be good fun to do it for, for the guys. And, uh, yeah, so, all right. So, um, Pete, are you going? ready? I am 100% ready. Okay, and uh, people at home, FFUK is at home. Are you ready? You can just just say it, just say it back. Uh, no. And then, um, uh, right, Bakes, are you ready? I'm ready. Yeah, should we go? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Let's um, let's try and isolate the correct answers here. <clears throat> isolate. <laughs> <laughs> nice. That is. Bye. I don't think that's going to work, Chris. Not. <laughs> no, no, I don't either. But I had to try. It's I had to throw it in. I had to throw it in. Uh, right. okay uh yeah here we go let's let's dive into this so we're going to do a classic quiz which will be what we do every time so it is your game pin it's one seven one two four four eight so enter that into the kahoot app okay one seven one two double four eight it's like a, one of these charity phone lines isn't it <laughs> uh <laughs> yeah so you just you must so Type that number in. As soon as they type in that number, how long does it take to start? We've got, we JP. Go. We've got JP. We've got Pete C. Pete, Pete C. C. Carter. Carter plays mine. That must be Ben Carter. Reedy. Uh, Reedy. Ian G. Excellent. Let's give this a little while longer. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. James Amar. Good. Jablo. Justin. In. JP Wolof. Oh, we've got more people than than, than I had on my uh, screen watching. So that's good. Eight players. Oh, the Pace Chatton boys are in. Good. good Nine good, good. players. That is a good number. Excellent number to start with. Uh, let's give it another 30 seconds to see if anyone else joins. And then uh, yeah. and then I guess you just press the start button, yeah, Bakes? And we press just the start off. button and then they're, and we're in and we're ready to go. So now we'd have some sort of maybe countdown music on the proper one for this. I reckon. So I've, I've, on my screen, I've got you're in. See your nickname on screen. And then I see my nickname. I can't do anything. I assume that changes when we start. You will, yeah. For some reason, yeah. oh, Justin dropped out. Has he come back in again? See, that's why we that's why we have you here. Justin's dropped out, but we'll wait for him to rejoin if we can. Somebody's come back in. We've still got nine players. Oh, here he is. He's is he back? What's Justin doing? He's got strike uh, through his name. JPC saying that he may have two two other teams joining. Right. Does he want us to wait? I'm saying they need to be quick. So uh, we've got Justin back. So if we get 10, um, you know, let's, we'll, we'll go. Um, yeah, but there's only so long, you know, we can fill, fill time for, you know. So many, right, yeah. uh, so if the long people want to stay, 
stare at a screen with a big number on it. Okay, he's saying, "Give me a moment." Okay, well, while we wait, um, <laughs> what can we what can we chat about? Well, well do, you, um, do you want another fact? Yeah, yeah go I'll for it, Pete. Yeah. Yes, please. Um, okay, so one of the birds I was looking at recently was um, I don't know Easy. if you've ever yeah yeah I don't know if you've heard of the hobby bird, but the the hobby is a um, small bird of prey, uh, a Eurasian bird, although they are. Uh, international there's also sorts of different types but the eurasian is um known as a a, a, a falco sabutio is it it's known as a falco sabutio and um so the um the person who patented sabutio back in the day was literally just going to call the game hobby um, but because uh, they wouldn't let him do that, he changed the name to Sabutio. And um, that's how Sabutio got its name. It got its name off uh, the hobby bird. Well, that's very interesting, Pete. There you go. I've got more where that came from. Wonderful. <laughs> Can't wait to hear that. Shall we, shall we get this get this show on the road? Well, hold on. Uh, JPC's got two more people joining. Uh Oh, hold on. Who's that? Hate Nick Gers, whoever that is. Okay. Uh, we've got nine. We've, have we lost? We lost Justin. No, we've still got Justin, haven't we? Yeah. But somebody else dropped out. Maybe they changed their nickname to Hate Nick Gers. Ah, uh, okay. Fine. Fine. Uh, was it the? No, the. Uh, okay, they're putting the pin in now. Okay. There we go. Uh, great. So we've got. Is that ten? Is that all of them? Yeah. That's ten. Um, or is it? Was it? Mm. Okay. Shall we go? Paul, will my screen automatically change? Yeah. Yeah, it will. Yeah, yeah, will, yeah, will, yeah, will, yeah. will. Yeah, I'm okay. waiting. Just you just just hold your horses. Ooh. Hold your horses. All I've will got... become clear momentarily when we uh, wait. Thirty seconds. Wait thirty seconds. I'm being asked. I've got, I've got dodgy. In so, uh, apologies to viewers. This is our first first go at this. And, uh, some, you know, these are teething problems. We're no problem. We're going to get through this. Yeah. And the quiz is so so damn good. Once it gets that is going. true. That is true. Yeah. This yeah. Is, we need if we had some build up music, this would be fine. This is what they do on the, those oh, shows. It's about, it's about twenty it. minutes of build up. Can you hear this music? Very quietly. It's dreadful. Hang on. What else we got? <laughs> we got some disco. That's lovely. That's lovely. Green, right, so we've got eleven now. We've got the green. The greens are in, and uh, yeah. So I reckon I said we're going to we'll give it a, a minute. So we'll give it thirty seconds, and then we go. So I'll do a countdown in twenty seconds. Right. Yeah. Just just let me know when we're ready to go. I'll get the music back on. Okay. Okay. They're in. They're in. So we're ready to go. Let's get the music on. And uh, three, two, one. Bakes. Whenever you're ready. Let's get <laughs> on the <our> own. <laughs> Right. Here okay, here we go. Go. okay, yeah, it's working. Are you ready? Ten questions. Question one. Here we go. Oh, that's hard. How many teams How many have teams competed in the, in the Premier League? Yes. Sorry, Bates, you read out the question. 57, 53, or 45. Uh, eight seconds left to answer. Got nine How many teams answers. have competed in the Premier League? Uh, three, three went 49, and that was the correct answer. Only three wow. of you got it right, though. And Six now we'll, we'll... 53, which was the wrong answer. Yeah, close, though. Close. Should we see who got the right answer. Let's see it. I did. Let's see who got it first as well. Ian Galloway got it first. JP and Reedy. <laughs> JP and Reedy already up there. Impressive. How come there's only five names up there? Does it only do the I top five? I think they five? just give you the leaderboard, just gives you the top five, to be honest. Yeah, and ah, there must be all, ze all zeros for the rest of them. I think I so, think yeah. So. so that's how it works, basically. Um, and, uh, yeah, let's... Uh, you can hide that, the next? that thing. Yeah, good. Um, yeah, go for it. Uh, next question, yeah. Question two, I think, is an FPL question. Here we go. Good, good. Mm. 
Which of the following is not in the top five for points score? This is this season among forwards. Who's not in the top five? Ings, Jimenez, Rashford or Firmino? Who's not in the top five for points score among forwards in FPL this season? Oh, Firmino. Oh, good knowledge. Good knowledge. That is cracking knowledge. Damn. Eight out of 11 got it right. Impressive. Eight that is really... Eight. 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 Did, you, did you get that one right? Yeah, I did. Yeah, I did all right. Well done. Well done. Well done. Rashford yeah, well is the curveball. I thought more would go for Rashford. Yeah. Because he's been injured so much. But let's have a look and see what that's done to the leaderboard. Ian G stays top. Reedy's up yeah, to... Yeah, it's impressive. Impressive. Here comes Pete. Look, there he is up to fourth. It is only giving us top five, though. Okay, never mind. Only giving us top five. Jablo Imar into the top five. And on we go. I think we've got another football question coming up. Brilliant. Yeah. Oh, who won the inaugural Nations League? Won the inaugural Nations League. Netherlands, Germany, England or Portugal. Who won the inaugural, by which I mean the first, Nations League? This was only last year. First and only, I think, so far, yeah. First and only, indeed. We've got 11 answers. Oh, interesting. A bit of a split there. Got it right. It was Portugal. They did beat Netherlands in the final. I think it was 1-0 from memory. One went England. God, dear. That was that was optimistic. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. I like it. Let's, uh, England beat Switzerland in the third place playoff on penalties. Let's see what that's done to the leaderboard. Ian G's oh, on, fire. on fire. Three, three, three in a row. Three out of three. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Okay. Um, Paul, you can actually hide. Sorry, you can actually hide that uh, thing in the bottom in the middle. If you press hide. Yeah, perfect. Okay, cool. Right, next question. And we are on to the fourth question of 10. Who currently sit in the Premier League relegation zone? Who are in the relegation zone? Is it Norwich, Bournemouth, Villa, Norwich, West Ham, Watford, Norwich, Watford, Brighton or Norwich, Villa, West Ham? Who currently, as things stand, sit in the Premier League relegation zone? Great question. We've all okay. looked at that table. We've all looked at that table. It goes and the majority have got that one right oh, as well. These spread. boys are good. These boys are good, mates. That spread. Goodness me, less than half oh, got it right. What's that done to the leaderboard? Ooh, Ian <gasps> just got it wrong. Look at this. Oh, and no, he I got it. one wrong. Plummets. Greedy. Reedy's up. Reedy up. Anyway, top. JP. JP's got all four right, but he hasn't got them right quickly enough, which is why he's third. And <laughs> also, he's got the highest answer streak of four in a row. Yeah, that's amazing. Four in a row. He's obviously taking his time. He's playing it. There's obviously the tactics, isn't it? If you take your time, get it right, or quickly get get the uh, get the one. Yeah, first in. Right, I think we might be moving out of the uh, out of the arena of football and into general sport with the next one. Here we go. Question five. Bloody Ooh. hell. Question five. Who currently lead the English Rugby Premiership? Is it Leicester, Saracens, Exeter or Wasps? Who currently lead the English Rugby Premiership? Leicester, Saracens, Exeter or Wasps? Five seconds to go. One more answer to come in, I think. Is there just ten answers? Exeter. Well done. Very good. Yeah. We've got some rugby, big rugby fans. Did you guess Ooh. that? Eh? Yes, I Where did. Did <laughs> Harrison, <laughs> Harrison's forgot that. I mean, I don't know what their points did up in what for their breach of the financial fair play. Something like ninety point the penalty deduction they've had this season. So they're Chris. certainly. Not going to be leading the English Rugby Premiership, but Chris, can I just just say a good quiz? A good quizzer guesses right. Very good. Thanks. I like. If you've got Very any good. more philosophy about quizzes, you should have brought that up earlier. <laughs> Fantastic. I see what that's done to the leaderboards. Uh, great. Oh, JP's up there. It's moved up. Three He's... places. Part of plays mine is the highest climb up, but not in the top. Five interesting. Well, why can't you see the rest of them? That's really annoying because we played. Well, anyway, really yeah. I'm not sure. No, no it's not your fault. It's not your fault. We'll uh, we'll get the FFUK lawyers on that. Uh, JP okay, up there. I think he must have got. Is that uh, is that uh, JPC? Do we think? I no, guess. that's JP, as in John um, Parkinson. John Parkinson. 
Ah, oh, Jay. I, I suspect he's got, got the page chat and boys as well. Yeah. I suspect he's got all five questions right so far, which is very he's impressive. He's doing, he's smashing it. Question six, I believe, if memory serves, is about American sports. Let's see what your American wow. sport is like. Here we go. Ooh. Tom Brady, legendary New England Patriots quarterback, the greatest of all time. Who did he sign for? Las Vegas, San Francisco, Tampa Bay, or Seattle? Where's Tom, Tom Brady going to be going next season? Vegas, Frisco, Tampa Bay, or Seattle? I have to admit, I did this one and I had no idea. And Tampa I guessed it. Bay. Um, oh, I loved it. Seven, seven people have got it right. It's literally the only piece of sports news in the whole of last week. Um, Damn it. Congratulations, those seven who got that. Tampa Bay Buccaneers is who will be playing for next season. Not my uh, Seattle Seahawks, unfortunately. Uh, although we Shame. have got Wilson, so we don't really need him. Uh, and what does that do to the leaderboard? Oh, JP State. and G's right up there again. Excellent. Okay. Bit of a yeah. gap. Ian G. Green. Pete's hanging in there. Pete is hanging in there. Yeah, tight. Hanging in, in. Did you get that one right, Pete? No, I didn't. I went for Ooh. Seattle. Oh, Peter, Peter. Yeah. Greens is the highest climber there, up three places. Right. Okay, next question, Bakes. Next question. Next question. This one's going to be about Olympic sport. Oh. Ooh. Oh, Olympic. Shite. The modern pentathlon, what's the final discipline? You must have watched this watching the Olympics. The modern pentathlon, what's the final discipline? Is it swimming, running, fencing, or shooting? The modern I've, ne pentathlon, I've, I've final never, never watched it, Paul. You missed a treat. I got it right. Did you get it right? <laughs> yeah. There you go. I, thought, yeah. I thought a run would be appropriate for the end. You know, you wouldn't end yeah. with fencing. <laughs> Logistically, those, it's a nightmare. Yeah, those are four of the five disciplines. The fifth, of course, being um, show jumping. And as 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 I'm not sure if this is an urban myth or not, but apparently they're the five skills you need. You need it as a Victorian to escape from a prisoner of war camp. <laughs> shooting, swimming, running, and uh, jumping over things with a horse. Wow, excellent, useful. Six people uh, got that one right. Let's see what that's done to the leaderboard after seven uh, questions. Jay, oh, we've got a new... Again, look, he's Jay, oh, so who's JP, who's JP Walloff then? We don't know who that is. Okay. Uh, make yourself he's known up. in the comments. And uh, Pete's up to fourth. The top three remain changed. Okay, well, um, yeah, um, Greens is the highest climber again. He must, Greens must be right up there now. Um, he must, must be, be just, sick. He that's must six, be sick. six places he's got up, so. Yeah. Uh, okay, right, got are we it. ready for the next question? We must be getting towards the end of the first round now. We've got three more questions to go. The next one's about English football. So this is non-Premier League football. Here we go. So... Well, the last team outside the top flight to win the FA Cup, West Ham United, Sunderland, Bolton Wanderers or Blackburn Rovers. Well, the one. last team outside the top flight to win the FA Cup. I'll tell you, I've gone for Bolton. No. Oh, I mean, two got it right. My beloved West Ham United, 1980, beat Arsenal 1-0, Trevor Brooking header. Glorious. Absolutely glorious, but only two that this is sorting out the men from the boys <laughs> to the leaderboard now. Oh, JP didn't no change. Oh, geez, close the gap just a 500 point gap. I, see, I don't know what you get for if you get it right and you get it really quickly. I'm not sure exactly how many points you get, but it must be a fair few hundred. So I think it's a thousand, isn't it? I thought it was a thousand, but maybe it's, I think they do the, do the scoring differently depending on how many people are playing and, and stuff Might like well that. Do. So, Might yeah. well do. Still, I think chances for ENG. I suspect it's gone for the rest of uh, rest of the competitors, but there are oh, two. Oh, you never know. No, you never know in this game. You never know. So I think we're back to an FPL question now. Good. We go to question nine. Simple. Quite an easy one. 
It's all about speed. Who scored the most FPL points in a single season? Mo Salah, Sergio Aguero, Cristiano Ronaldo or Frank Lampard? Which player has scored the most FPL points in a single season? Salah, Aguero, Ronaldo, Lampard. Oh, Mo yes, Salah, so. of course it was. Of course it was. Oh, five, of you did, five of you didn't get it, though. But yeah, six of you did. Six people got it right. Of course, it was Mo Salah. Let's see what that's done to the leaderboard. Cool, Justin got it right. The gap has closed, answered it faster. Look at that. Yeah. 370-odd point gap. Justin up to fourth. Did you get that one right, Pete? <clears throat> Did you not? No. No. What? Oh, no. I had, I had I had Ronaldo in my head before the answers came up, and then so as soon as I saw it, I was like, bang. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, oh dear. Clinging uh, on to fifth there, Pete, though. And into the final question, which takes us back to the Premier League. Here we go. Oh gosh. simple again. Who's made the most number of appearances in the Premier League? Carragher, James, Lampard, or Barry? It's definitely Who's one of them. Number Chris. of appearances in the Premier League. Is it Jamie Carragher, David James, Frank Lampard, or Gareth Barry? Oh, thank God for that. Most people got the answer right. It was, of course, Gareth Barry. It couldn't be anyone else. Great. So let's have a look at our final leaderboard. The podium. Look at this. The podium. Oh, what is it? G is in third. Reedy Reedy in second. And a comfortable runaway winner is JP. Excellent. And we had uh, Justin in fourth and Pete C in fifth. Uh, I've done a screenshot there. So uh, we could have you done a those. screenshot, yeah? Yeah, that's, so that's good. Man, good. Um, great. So uh, one of the only comment there uh, in the group when, when the guys were doing the quiz there, Paul, was that one of the guys uh, was struggling to do the answer the questions. In It was timing out before he was getting to the question. So because we're on a bit of a delay here, um, uh, can no. we can we extend the the time uh, for yeah, the question? Yeah, I can do, yeah. You just have to give yeah. me a minute. If you stop the screen sharing, then I can go and fix yeah, the we'll other quizzes and make them sort of yeah. 30 seconds. We'll do that. Um, and Peter, myself and yourself, uh, that, did, how did you enjoy the first round there? Um, I, I very much enjoyed it, actually. Um, I found a couple think, of the questions quite tough and I, I think I let myself down on a couple of other answers. So, um, Well, not the first time for that. This is true. Have you stopped um, the screen share, Chris? I have, yeah, Paul. Yeah, you carry on now. Yeah, great. Perfect. Uh, um, yeah, so, so, so you... Then, there were some good questions there, um, some things to get me thinking. Um, obviously, a bit gutted about uh, the highest ever FPL scorer. Sometimes when I find, because I've got so much knowledge, that, things, <laughs> <laughs> that, that some facts just sort of spill out. Yeah, so actually you've got so much knowledge that some of your knowledge is wrong. I didn't, wouldn't say wrong. Well, if you thought the, Ronaldo was the highest scorer of the... In FPL, that's a wrong fact. Well, I've never been asked to think of it before. Uh, well, yeah, but that's not that's not a valid excuse. Uh, it depends. I mean, it's not a court of law. <laughs> I'm, I'm surprised when you were doing a sports quiz, you didn't look up who was the uh, highest point scorer of all time in FPL. Well, I'll have to take that on the chin, I'm afraid. Um, <laughs> You know, Although I it's spent, easy for me to say, I'm not. I'm not the one answering the questions. And I spent I'll admit, a lot, Pete, a lot when of I time, <laughs> a lot of time looking at non-league football. I'll be honest. <laughs> I'll be honest with you, there are no questions about non-league football in this quiz. Bugger. <laughs> not a single one. Bugger. <laughs> right. Okay. Are we ready for the next round then, uh, Mr. Baker? We. Oh, yes. Yeah. So all the questions now, you should have 30 seconds to answer, not 20 seconds. OK, so hopefully that will then help with the uh, whoever it was who was uh, just struggling with the time. Um, but I think then as soon as we get all 11 answers in, it goes anyway. So uh, I think it, yeah, we're it. round two. Uh, so now, questions a little bit harder now, Bakes. That's what you're saying. Oh, my God. Questions going to get a little bit harder. 
Um, it will follow the same structure, though. So I, I think it's Premier League, FPL, general okay. football, and then, you know, okay. as the same kind of subjects in exactly the same order that we had them before. Great. Well, I, I'm ready. Are you ready, Pete? Yeah, I guess so. OK, well, right. let's, let's do it. Everyone. Yeah, good luck, everyone. You'll get a new pin to enter this quiz. So uh, yeah, we're coming up in a moment. Get your pins out. There we go. What's the pin? There's the pin. Eight one eight four two three two. Waiting. Sorry. Yeah. And here the players start coming in. Excellent. Well, hopefully. Pete's first. Pete, well. There's Pete. You don't. You don't need an FFUK afterwards, but that's fine. Well, I, I, yeah, I suppose I could just be Pete, couldn't I? Ah, so Ron Ronnie Friel is uh, JP Walloff. Whatever that uh, is. Ah, lovely. What is? Is he a writer or something? JP Walloff. I have done no. Know. Ron Boy, uh, tell, well, Ronnie, I think that is. Tell us, tell us what JP Walloff is. Um, <laughs> <I don't know. laughs> what? Fat Chris. Oh, <laughs> yeah, cheers for that, whoever that is. Oh, it's JP. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oops, something's going a bit funky with this. That's all right. So someone's just done oh, do, 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 just whatever. The problem is whoever's gone fat Chris, you clever person, we can't tell who that is. So I reckon it's oh could I guess who it is? No, I won't do that. I won't do that. Bald bakes. There's loads of them. Hang on. Somebody's printing something out next to me. That's not gonna be Printing. No Who's done this like FGSF thing? It's not. It's clearly not working. Doesn't, doesn't like it. Can doesn't you change like it. The name? Whatever FGFS is whatever. Um, right. Okay. We go in all eleven. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Thanks for that. That's great. Let's go. Let's just hope that the people who come up with funny names aren't very clever and don't get don't get on the leaderboard. Yeah. Too wrong. Too wrong. <laughs> Oh, Here we go. Question one, Premier League. Right, you got your 30 quests, 30 seconds now. How many current Liverpool... Oh, straight in. No, 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 no. Paul, that didn't work. It's just timed out straight away. Oh, really? Yeah, timed out instantly. No, all the players have answered. I haven't. Yeah. It, didn't, it didn't do the timer. It just clicked times up straight away. Well, okay. Well, let's, let's go to next and see what happens. It just says times up. It can always start it again. Yeah, it's gone wrong there. Look. Okay. So go. If you it's because of this. It's because of this guy. Yeah. Look, he's got all the results. Yeah. Thanks. Right, if you yeah. end that quiz, we'll end this. and I will, I'll stop the share. You get stop it straight up. Um, yeah. I know it's um funny to enter different names, but it would be helpful if we knew who you were. Um, and also, it seemed to crash when you did that for some reason. Uh, I think that might be it. Might have been a bot or something. Possibly, yeah. I mean, who knows? Um, have you stopped sharing? Yeah, I've stopped sharing. Yeah, makes you go for it. Yeah. Um, these these are the things that we're learning. You see, the first time we've done it, so it looks like it's timed out for everyone. That's fine. So um, when Bates, we'll, uh, we'll go again. We'll go again. Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, so we are looking again at round two. Uh, get ready, everyone. You know what the question is, but you've got to think about what the answer is. <laughs> Here we okay. go. You'll have probably seen the answer as well. No, we didn't. Oh, no, it's going to set it up. You've got, so it's going to give you another pin. Okay, so you're going to have New to... Pin. Uh, Let's look pin. out for that, that bot. So we know we've got to get our 11 people in. Uh, we don't want an FGSG or whatever. Yeah, we... Okay, so they're about nine seconds. Jet JP Jackson is about nine seconds behind. We've got seven, we're waiting for four more. We got we know we've got eleven players, so
yeah so they're eight or nine seconds behind this is kind of this is handy to be able to to do this kind of practice one with got with you guys it's helpful sorry for any uh delays but we're getting there seven players so is anyone else joining this one we just got another uh, one to read in eight excellent okay uh okay we'll give it a couple we'll give it another 30 seconds three fat weird guys great That's oh we're up to 10 now up to 10 yeah not sure who three fat weird guys is i can't imagine who they're referring to no <laughs> okay i reckon we go for it i reckon we may have lost a team uh no problem let's do it uh Ready 10, to go. 10 players let's, yeah, go. let's go good luck everyone back to question number one How many current Liverpool players were signed from Southampton? And it's how many current Liverpool players were signed from Southampton? Four, five, six, or seven? What do you reckon, Chris? Oh, oh it's tricky, isn't it? I mean, you know it's a few, but Liverpool it's probably less than time. seven. I don't know. It's hard. I, I don't want to give anyone any clues. Mm. Yeah, fair point. Sorry. Have you answered already? Yeah, I've answered. Yeah, I think one person didn't answer. No, I got yeah. it wrong. Uh, five. Interesting. Yeah. Okay, so only two people got it right. Yeah. 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 Well, I went. I went four. I went four. Uh, so, um, oh, who's the right back? Nathaniel Klein. Oh yeah. The player, he's Alone. just been injured. For so like, got... injured in pre-season, he's still officially a Liverpool player. Tell me if I'm wrong. So Mane, uh, yeah. Hendo. No, no. Lalana, Lovren, Lovren, yeah. yes. Um, and there was another really obvious Van one. Van Dyke, of course, the Van obvious. Dyke. Oh yeah. And Nathaniel Klein of the five. And there's right. one, the other one that was signed from Southampton, but of course has um, since left. Okay. Well, let's see. Oh, let's see who got it right. There's only two people got it right. Who got it right? Let's have a look. D. 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 Is that, D. Who's that? Daz? Daz, maybe? don't know. And uh, the, PC the PC boys. boys. Yes. Of course, they got it right. Absolutely. Great. Okay, next question. Next question. Question two. Question two. An FPL. Which of the following is one of the top five midfielders for points scored this season? Who's in the top five amongst the midfielders for points scored this season? Oh, that is tricky because normally there's one name there. You just say, "Yeah, he's he must be top five, but he's been injured." So I might have only set um, the first question to be thirty Alex. seconds. Will the others might still oh, be twenty? Oh no! Okay, we can sort that afterwards, can't we? I might uh, have to do that for the third round, or do you want me to sort it out now? No, I think we carry on. I think it's unfortunate. Uh, With a that means they've got ten seconds, but yeah. Hmm. Okay. With apologies. They were quick to answer, though, he said. Yeah, OK. OK, well, we'll carry on for this round. The next round will make it 30 seconds every I'll question. Do it. I'll do it. I think I can do it for the whole quiz. Okay. Last time. Yeah. So the answer is Richarlison. Richarlison's in the top five midfielders for points scored this season. Not Good. Green. OK, three, three got it right. Who got it right? Let's have a look. Three new players. Ooh, three new, new names. JP. JP Champ, I like it, JP. Uh, Reedy and my dad uh, all up uh, on the leaderboard. Great. Right, let's next question. Take it, you've got both wrong so far. Is that that is absolutely true? Oh, yeah, I went, um, yeah, I went for the wrong answer. If it was a partridge, <laughs> question be fine. Absolutely. Question three. Here we go. Oh, hold on, hold on. So we've got someone questioning if yours is all right. He's got six. Which there. of the, which of the oh, following is yeah. not? Won the UEFA European Championships. Who's not won the UEFA European Championships? Oh, I've lost my connection. <laughs> Denmark, Yugoslavia, Czech, or the Soviet Union? Who's not won the UEFA European Championships? Yeah, it's quite quick, isn't it? 20 seconds there. Um, we'll just have to finish this one, I think. Yeah, okay. 
we'll crack on through this and we'll yeah, get on. Crack on, too. absolutely. Yeah. So we got two got the right answer there. Two, six, seven, only seven answered. You see, so yeah. Uh, Daz is Daz is winning though. If it is D, D is Daz. Yeah. Um, okay. okay. Next question. Question four. Who currently likes Ooh. the league? Yeah. Who are currently tenth in the Premier League? Is it Everton, Palace, Arsenal, or Burnley? Everton, Palace, Arsenal, or Burnley? Who currently like tenth in the Premier League? I gotta get one of these right. Come on. It's Burnley. No. Peter. Oh, he's doing got it right. I th I thought Burnley would be higher up than that. Yeah, oh, no, mate. Tenth. I I went for Everton. So we've also got a Stuart inquiry on your five Southampton players, Bakes, because Justin said there's six. Oh right, he's wrong. Look, oh, Mane, Van Van Dyke, Klein, Lalana, Lovren, Ox. I don't. Was the Ox signed? The Ox was signed from Arsenal. What's he talking about? Yeah, but he, he was at Southampton before that. He wasn't signed from Southampton, though. Oh, yeah, but I... Oh, is that the question? Oh, okay, okay. Signed from Southampton. Oh, okay, interesting, interesting. Not who have played... Yeah, Justin. Justin and yeah. James. Come on, you got to read the question, <laughs> Justin. Read the question, honestly. Uh, okay, right, next question. Let's 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 crack on with this one. Five. When, Eng when England won the Cricket World Cup in 2019... Oh, man. England Super <laughs> Over. All the Super Over. Is it Mark Wood, Joffre Archer, Liam Plunkett or Ben Stokes? When we won the Cricket World Cup last year, who bowled the Super Over? Wood, what Archer, an over. What an over. I don't think I've ever been more excited in an over. Or maybe I have, actually. But it's been very, yeah, it's very close. Archer, of course it was. Brilliant. Brilliant. I think you got that one right, Pete. <laughs> no, Pete's oh, struggling. Yeah. Pete's struggling. Oh, oh dear. Have we got a music round? You know no, we it? don't. Um, <laughs> <laughs> oh, Daz has lost his top spot. If it is Daz, otherwise I'm just calling him Daz. But D's lost his top spot. Jablo Amar, James Amar is right up there now. Space okay, Power. let's yeah, let's go on to the next one. See how that goes. Oh, gosh. American sports. Who is the all-time leading NBA point scorer? Is it LeBron, Shaquille, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, or Michael Jordan? Who's the lead all-time leading NBA point scorer? Who's the GOAT? It's K-A-J, as no one calls him. Um, oh, I didn't know that. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And wow. From LeBron in second. And he wasn't he in um, Airplane? Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. Yeah, I think he was. Yeah. Yeah, he was. Yeah, yeah. There you go. There's your fact. Oh. The leaderboard. Oh, oh PC James Amos. Page chat and boys are right up there in second. Yeah. Impressive for a little. And they've gone up. Uh, and JP Walloff, who's Ronnie, he, we don't know why he's JP Walloff, uh, is up three <laughs> places. Very impressive. On to the next question. Olympic sports. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Which of the following is a class of boat in Olympic sailing? Is it the Finn, the Morgan, the Harley, or the Logan? Can you see what I did there? Which of the following is a class of boat in Olympic sailing? Is it Finn, Morgan, Harley, or Logan? This is some for your comic book fans, is it this one? It's a I'm, I'm good gonna... knowledge, guys. Well, good. Very knowledge. good. Five of you. Impressive. These are hard I questions. You've been though. watching their Olympic sailing. Of course you have been. Why wouldn't you? <laughs> I told <turned> Val. <laughs> <laughs> James Amar's on fire. Answer streak. He is on four. four and a 400 run. point lead. Wow. I thought this was a hard quiz. Absolutely smashing it. On we go. Back to English football. Question eight. Which English football team are known as the Biscuit Men? Is it Wigan, Bristol City, Reading or Burnley? Which English football team are known as the Biscuit Men? Who would have a nickname, the Biscuit Men? Well, one of these teams does. It's a ridiculous nickname, can I just say? It is a ridiculous nickname. And 
Oh, oh really? Really? The majority of it, were they all guesses? They may have just all been guesses. Now that must be because they that's have a biscuit really. factory there, I guess. Yeah, that's Unilever, what I was Unilever or something, maybe. I don't know. Fifties. Could be. Was Reading the biscuit man? What's that done to the leaderboard? <gasps> We've got a new leader. Got a new leader, Ian Galloway. Four four win streak, correct? A win streak, four impressive. Win and impressive. And Okay, okay. So now we're getting into the uh, final last, throws of the, this round. Fine, last two questions. This one's back to FPL. Here we go. Slightly complicated question. Before Mo Salah's 29-point haul in 2017-18, who had previously held the title of the highest points total in a game week with 28 points? Aguero, Lampard, Walcott, or Berbatov. I've had to Ooh. take a punt. And that's no, a single game wrong. week, isn't it? Yeah, right. yeah. Okay. Is, oh, yeah, only one person got it right. For which I apologise. Only one went Lampard. And it was Lampard. Nobody went Theo Walcott. I think he's either the second or the third. Mm -hmm. I, got, I went Berbatov. I remember Berbatov yeah, getting five goals. Four or five goals in a game yeah. in, a, in, a, in a match, yeah. But not quite as many as Lampard. Oh, always, always the oh, midfield. Oh, up. The top. He got and it. we've got one question to go, isn't it? One question yeah. to go. So it's between those two, between uh, games and like that, yeah. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, look at this! Oh, is this the Aguero? Aguero! The Man City beat to win their first Premier League title on the final day of 2011-12. Is it QPR, Middlesbrough, West Ham, or Arsenal? Oh, oh I remember, good I remember watching this crowd. game. Yeah, yes, seven. Of course, seven. it was QPR. Joey good Barton on. got sent off. Here's the podium. Oh, let's have a look. Day. Who's third? I, I suspect I might not be on it. Podium oh, again. Ing second. I think we know what that means. James Amar, congratulations for winning the second round. <laughs> Justin in fourth. Pace Chan boys in fifth. Well played, guys. Okay, uh, let's just go straight on, I think, Paul, to the third round. I did round, have a, 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 oh, no. the time. a very yeah, short break. Time. Okay, you're going to go. Bakes, you're going to uh, – I've, I've removed the shared screen, so you crack on. Cool. Uh, and if you're at home and you fancy a toilet break, now's the time. We've done two rounds. So I, I'm just going to mess uh -huh. up. Uh, yeah, I hope, I hope it's, uh, you're enjoying our home. Uh, it's um, it, we, As I say, this is a bit of a playing it by ear version. We will polish it up for the next time. Um, but yeah, it's, um, oh, it's well, two cracking rounds so far. And I hope for Pete's just gone for a, for a wee, otherwise we're in trouble, but hoping there's a way to easily set this to the all the you think you can do select all or something wouldn't you but yeah i might have to do each question in turn which might just, just take okay seconds. it's worth doing i think because the guys who are watching it who are just like 10 eight or nine seconds behind it's it's a bit yeah. bit tight really 10 seconds so it's no good is it so yeah it won't take long let me just Yep, it down. Yep, it down. Back. Excellent. So I, I assume this is the easiest round coming now, yeah? <laughs> Here we go. So James well, has do, been do your round next, followed by the uh the dastardly one, Chris, or shall I just go straight into Oh the... there there's two uh, more rounds, amazing. Maybe go for my round then. Why not? We could do your one followed by the uh the brute. <laughs> They, of course, they still all follow the same process. So, um, in terms of yeah, so so these questions, yeah, I came up with. So, um, yeah, if they're too hard, it's my fault. Interestingly, at least two of the questions, Chris, were questions that I'd come up with separately for my own quizzes as well. Let's come up. Great with minds. Great <laughs> minds, indeed. Okay, so are we ready to go back and share? One second. Yes, we are. Oh no! Hang on! Hang on! Hang on! Okay. Hang, on hang on! We're going to do. We're doing number four first, aren't we? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I see. Yes. Yes. We're ready to go. 
Excellent. Right. So this is my round. Uh, this is the questions I wrote. So maybe I'll read these ones out. Uh, and uh, on we go, Bakes, whenever you're ready. And whenever everyone's ready at home, get your Here we go. thing out. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> so the pin for this one is 582-6728. 582-6728. Waiting for players. Here we go. Uh, hold it's, like, um, it's like those bingo things or something, isn't it? You know, isn't it? Here's the, you know, I don't know why I thought that. Uh, I've lost the internet or something. Is it like bingo? No, I hate it. <laughs> it's not really like bingo. I've I've got, got, Names lost. are coming in. Hey, what are you doing? Are you, you struggling got, for internet? Yeah, I got loads of in ad adverts came up when I pressed the button and now... I'm not getting into that. Okay. Turn it off and turn it on. Th thanks. <laughs> We've got six players at the moment. We haven't got Pete yet, for goodness sake. I know, I'm trying. Hold on. Oh, a funny one again. Jay to the Should we start this one again? Yeah, it looks like, yeah, start it again. Yeah, can you can you stop it? We got to start that one again, guys. Sorry about that. That's weird how it does that, Bakes. Yeah, I, I don't know what that's what's going on with that. I think Pete might be right. It might be some kind of bot that's messed. Yeah. That's weird. Yeah, it could be. Could be. Okay. What's the pin? Uh, what's going on? Do, I'll restart it because um, we had a bot again, and we think or something. All uh, right. Yeah, mine wouldn't load at all. Okay, well, yeah, we've got maybe. Bakes, are we ready? Bakes, are we yeah, ready? Maybe. Yeah, yeah, it's all up there now, yeah. Okay, so. Sorry that we were sharing. Yeah, yeah, it's good to go. Guys, when you're ready, it's 2-2-1, 2 2 one 2 7 one 4 I might, I might go, uh, come back in a sec. There he is. Right, I'm in. Okay, name's looking good. Reedy. Yeah, here he is. Any more for any more? Oh, no, look at this. Someone else copying the name or something. Oh, because it's coming up Reedy. What do you want to do, Chris? Should we start it again? Again? He's not here. I think you'll have to, Paul. You can't. Um, uh, there's James. Amar's just joined. I think James Amar just joined. Yeah. I think we'll have to. Uh, sorry, guys. I think we're going to have to start restart on again, unfortunately. We're getting this flickering we got when we to start up. Um, oh, no. We've got that thing again. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna close it down and start it again. Let's give this one more go. Sorry, guys. That's all right. Not your fault. Um, let me put a comment on the thing just in case people can't. <sighs> Are we getting comments on our YouTube page? Millions, for you. Well, I'm, <laughs> I'm, no, that I, I meant it as in like. Are there any uh, people we don't no, know? Not really. we've, we've, we've had, no, no, we've had some people telling us that, the, like JPC's been telling us that the delay is due to the casting and yeah, um, yeah, I stuff can like see, that. I can, I can see the live comments here. I just didn't know oh, if there were gamers on the YouTube channel. Yeah, they are, yeah. Yeah, Yeah. okay. We've got the new pin up. So, yeah. Great. Great. Okay, let's try again. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, guys. So round three, four, nine, two, oh, one, two, nine. That's uh, four, nine, two, oh, one, two, nine. I've got, I've got loads of side. I bought, just bought two more silence, so I'll be all right for a bit. <laughs> so annoying. It's okay. We're okay at the moment. The, the players yeah. are coming in. I don't. I, so you think someone else is watching it? And nah, I mean, I don't know. We got there. He is. 
See, look, he's done it again. No, it's what. okay, Dan. Let's no, try and play it. Uh, Hope you try and play it. Can you kick him out? Face. Try and kick him out. Or, or He's gone now, he's gone. Oh, yeah, if you Who's, click on Is everyone here? Okay, right. So we've got eight. Are you in, Pete? Yeah, you're in. Yeah, I think, I think everyone's here. Okay, one more, one last reminder. Four nine two zero one two nine. We are going three two one, and we're going. Sure. Now. Are we missing anybody we're expecting? I think I, I'm. I'm pretty sure it looks good. Let's do it. Here we go. On you. Yeah. Chris. Uh, yeah. Yeah. It's good. It's good. Yeah. Let's see. We've got eight people watching the stream. It sounds about. It's about right. I'll give the number. Oh, I can't remember hmm. the number now. Highest amount of goals ever scored in a Premier League game. Is it 10, 11, 12 or 13? Highest amount of goals ever scored in a Premier League game. 10, 11, 12 or 13? Extra see bonus point. See the game point. pin at the bottom there. The game. Oh, look, everyone's already in. Game pin's uh, 4920129. And did we have 30 seconds there? I didn't check, Banks, but I'm sure we, we did. We did have 30 seconds. Yes, we did. Oh, oh, time flies when you are having fun. Um, okay, so uh, let's get it. Let's have a look on the next. Yes, yeah, so we've got the pin there. If anyone hasn't already joined, four nine two zero one two nine. Okay. Should we have a look at the leaderboard? Yeah, let's have a look at the leaderboard. Definitely. Look who's up there again. Oh, same people. He's doing well. Okay, uh, we've got Ronnie up there as well, and J to the P, which is obviously JP. Um, excellent. Okay, uh, next question, please. Question two. Hmm, good question. FPL question. Which player has the most bonus points awarded so far this season? Is it Jamie having a party Vardy, Terence Trent Alexander-Arnold, Sadio Mane, or Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang? Oh, thank you for giving their full names. No oh, problem, oh no! Uh, oh, that's, what a sting! Uh, that's fascinating. Everyone, well, five people went Mane. Fascinating. Uh, the correct answer is Pierre Emerick Aubameyang. Ba 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 ba. Shrimp. Yeah, let's see what that's done. That's going to shake it up a bit. J to the P's up there now, JP. No messing. Reed Bot as well. Okay, yeah, of course he is. Of course he is. Reed Bot. Uh, okay, next question, please. Question master. Oh, oh, Christopher. In what year was the first red card ever shown in English football? Was it 1956, 1966, 1976, or 1986? All questions. They've all got it right. Half of them have got it right. Very surprised. Oh, yeah. yeah, we've got some good quizzes. Good quizzes amongst us. 1976, and they never had a red card before then. No. Uh, oh. JP got a winning streak of three answers in a row. I think we're only on question three, aren't we? We are. We are, yeah. Good. Fantastic. Okay, uh, who's next? And no, we've it's... got. Oh, here we go. Uh, so this is another FPL question. And it's which forward has played the most minutes so far this season overall? Uh, shoot. Uh, so you've got up there some forwards who've played a lot of minutes. Which ones? Which one has played the most? No. Um, we answer it. Yeah, Pookie has got three people have answered Pookie. Thing of that one. Correct answer. Pookie was correct, yeah. He had a little injury, but it wasn't long, and he's literally yeah, played every... There could have easily been any of them. Well, they were the top four, to be fair. Yeah. Uh, I, I didn't want to make it too well, easy for you. On logical. Well, I knew these some of the, some of you guys are good FPL players, so I thought, you know... <laughs> like people team. above you in the league. Oh, every, everyone <laughs> above me. Oh. Uh, I'm moving swiftly on, Bakes, please. Yeah. <laughs> Here we go. JP's still at the top, but... Uh, Ronnie's uh, up there behind him and my dad's back up there in third. Impressive. Okay, next question. 
Ooh. And it's a tennis question. Um, and it's in what year did Wimbledon introduce yellow tennis balls? White. Uh, was it 1980, 1986? It's definitely one of them. Yeah. Uh, well, no, I'm right. Oh. Thanks, what do well, I win? Well, well, well. <laughs> Goodness Woo! me. I've really the first time we've had that. <laughs> 1986. Wow. Goodness me. What's that done? Yeah, to before me? that was literally apparently. nothing. Nothing at all. Let's crack on to the next one. Leaderboard at all. American sports. Oh gosh. I love this one. I love this one. <laughs> which, which sport do you associate the name Dick Trickle with? Is it is it uh, NASCAR? Is it NFL? Is it baseball? Is it ice hockey? Obviously, this is an American sports question. Uh, Dick Trickle. What, what does the first thing you think of? Uh, oh, NASCAR. I thought there might be some Dick Trickle experts out there. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, okay, great, fantastic. Six of you got that one right. Let's have a look at the leaderboard. Oh, we've got a new leader. It's Ronnie. Here he comes. <coughs> I, have, I have to say, there's one person who's uh, very obvious by his absence from this leaderboard. What's happening, Peter? What's going on? Mate, I'm, I'm seriously struggling. I'm seriously struggling. I need I, some. I wrote these questions for you. No, you didn't. Um, they're not necessarily uh, knowledge based, though. They're sort of. Oh, they're not. Guess, oh, they're, not. They're, they're guessing uh, questions. Oh, so give me a no one. Give me a bird <laughs> question. Six people knew the answer to that one, Pete. <laughs> okay, uh, let's crack on. <laughs> Olympic sport next. Oh, shit. Oh, yes. <laughs> my favourite. So, it's quite simple, this one. In the first ever Olympics. Athletes completed in the nude. Is that true or is it false? Pete, I wrote this one especially for you. Well, I love it. Um, What's the answer? Well, don't say it, obviously. Cause... Oh, it's a good split. I actually Five got this one right. On oh, Pete, <laughs> it's true. It is true. The first Quite good ever bit of history. <laughs> in Roman times, the athletes all competed in the nude. Did you know? Well, three of you did. Oh, look at that. It's changed the whole leaderboard. Readbot's right up into third. Oh, we've got we got some... I mean, I reckon there's, there's still time for me here. It's tight for second at yeah. the moment. A little way to go to get to Ronnie. What question are we on? Question are we on? That was question seven, so we've got three to go. Okay, okay. Three questions to go, all to play for. Here we are, into English football. Oh, yes. This one I had to check. So, at present, which team has been in the championship the longest? Okay, is it Sheffield Wednesday? Is it Derby? Is it Blackburn? Or is it Forest? I threw this one in for grants. That's a tough well, question. That's a tough question. It's even more. To, I think. Yes, I, I think I remember when it when it was as well. And when I tell you when it was, yeah, no, no, I got it as well. When I tell you when it was, Derby, that was 2007, 2008. They were, that was the last time they weren't in the championship. Um, so it just shows you it's not that long for the whole league to basically turn around. The new team so no one teams. got that? No one got no, it? No one. Wow. They went for Forest. Have they been down into League One? Is that why they've not been in the championship? I think that must be why, yeah. Or did they, yeah, it must be. They must have got relegated. What's that done to the leaderboard? Absolutely nothing. Tough, that question. Yeah, nothing again. We'll crack on, on to, to question, question nine. Eight. Nine, sorry. FPL. Okay, FPL. Pretty simple. Which goalkeeper has scored the most number of points so far this season? Is it Guaita of Palace, Henderson of, oh God, Sheffield United, Foster of Watford or Pope of Burnley? Horrible. It was between two, wasn't it, really? It had to be Pope or Henderson. Yeah, you did, yeah, Pope or Henderson. And, and uh, four people, the most, went for Pope. So, pretty decent. What's that done to the scoreboard? 
from nowhere. Impressive. What a run. And can he hold on? He's got that. I would say every single person on that leaderboard can still win this this round. Comfortably. Less than 200 points separating the top five. That's mad. It is. Ready? Okay. Yeah, let's do it. Final question, guys. It's a Premier League question. Here we go. What a tiebreaker. Which goalkeeper has the most assists ever in the Premier League with a total of five? I think I've picked the wrong answer. Good, good. I think you can change, actually. No, no. On both counts. So the correct answer is Schwarzer, and it's five. And when I found out, I was like, five assists? Has a goalkeeper ever got five assists? Apparently they have. I went for Friedel. There's a, there's, yeah, there's, there's, a, there's a problem. For some reason, that's given the wrong answer. Yeah, it wasn't Schwarzer, was it? It's Robinson. It's Robinson. <laughs> <laughs> so that, was, that was my second answer. When I said I thought I got it wrong, I went to <laughs> in my head to Robinson. Because I've put the wrong one as right on the thing. Or... I don't know. No, it's probably my fault. I've oh, t- really? Okay, all right, well... Uh, the, right, whoever got Mark Schwartz, so you're wrong. <laughs> <laughs> it was actually Paul Robinson. Um, but, oh, God, and it was only the question that mattered the most as well, obviously. Who won it then with the wrong answer? Reedy, must be, yeah. So Reedy won it, but actually... Re- Reedy, yeah. can you change your name next time so we know you're not a bot, please? No, I like a read bot. <laughs> I don't, I just, the other bots I don't like. Um, well, well played, Reedy. Uh, you won that one. And we have one final round to go. Yes. Taxi, yeah, yeah absolutely. All right, so here we go. So I'm getting loads of adverts again now. Don't right. worry, we've got, we've got time. Yeah, so, um, okay, I'm ready. Uh, the final round. Thanks, guys, for bearing with us. I know it's been taking a while. Uh, so final round, Bakes, when you're ready. I'm ready. And we're going to get in now it's seven seven three seven one oh two that's seven seven three seven one oh two i uh i feel like i need to contribute a music round to the next quiz i'm happy to take a music round because I can always do that, and you can do the other quizzes, you see. Oh, that's a good idea. Yeah, um, so, uh, to be honest, um, sport isn't my strong point. <laughs> no, you'd rather have birds and music, yeah? I like I like birds. But no one else wants a round about birds, do they? Well, it depends what birds. Tits. <laughs> well, yes, we could potentially have a discussion about tits. Um, exactly. There's uh, at least four or five I can think of off the top of my head. Um, yeah. No, I, I don't mind. Yeah, we could absolutely open this up to do a sports, a sports round, a music round, a film round. Uh, oh, yes. This is just a, an opener, really, to see if people like it. And uh, partridge round for Pete, but my dad's suggesting that could be good. Um, and yeah, yeah absolutely, we can absolutely edit this and change this around. This is more like if people will enjoy it, we'll do it hey, yeah. uh, for the next few weeks um, until until my da- yeah my dad gets weirded out by Pete's waves. Surely, uh, surely, Ian, <laughs> surely Ian would love a music round. Oh, my dad would absolutely love a music yeah. round. Although I think he would say your music is too. Well, it's not prog rocky enough for him, probably. I don't know. <laughs> I'm pretty sure anyway. he's, he's quite good at uh, any music good. for anyway, about 50 years. Let's, yeah, let's crack on. So we've got, yes, oh, we've got six got players. It's not even in this one. What? 773-7102. We're not no, chatting. Hold on, hold on. Thank you, I said I was in. Here we are. Hey. Uh, there you are. Who are we missing? Okay. Uh, I don't know. We've got seven. Oh, got the, uh, we haven't got the Ronnie. 
No, we haven't. I've got Reedy. Yeah, Reed no, Bo Ronnie. So let's give him a bit longer. Seven seven three seven one zero two. Thanks, Jimmy. <laughs> also, here we go. Beautiful. Yeah. No, absolutely. I don't, I, we can. I'm going to green screen it next time, so I've got like a proper studio behind me. All right, good. Oh, beautiful. Let's take, let's take this to another level. <laughs> If we're going to, if we're sitting around. To uh, yeah, I want to crack on as well. Uh, we've got seven players. Oh, yeah, like... Bro Ronnie says he's got to go. Cheers, boys. Okay, all right. Well, let's crack on with seven. Yeah, let's do uh, it. Let's crack on with seven. These are the hard ones. Here we go. Oh, gosh. Okay, hard quiz round. In Good for luck, a penny. Guys. Let's go. Yeah, here we go. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Question one. Which of the following teams have spent more full seasons in the Premier League? Once you've understood what the question means, you can answer it. So which of these teams have spent more seasons in the Premier League than any other? And actually, it's not close. One of these teams has spent considerably more seasons in the Premier League than any of the other three. Which okay. of these four teams have spent more seasons in the Premier League than the others? We've got seven answers in. Oh, no. Oh, I, don't, I think I might have got there. Or, or maybe Palace, which three or oh. three of you got. It's, yeah. not, it's not close. Oh, yeah, they've won three or four more seasons than any of the other four. Sunderland. Not easy at all. Well, nobody's got that. So on we go. FPL. Tough LP, FPL question coming. Interesting. Which defender has the best form according to FPL at present? So as things stand, which defender has got the best form? Is it Doherty? Is it TAA? Is it Marc Alonso? Or is it the Lord Lundstrom? Oh, good oh, knowledge. Oh, really? Yes, no yes, yes. Right, fair play oh, yeah. to you. I'd have got, got Doc there. Yeah. Let's see who's got that right. Here are the five. Oh, hey. This is the yeah. only time. <laughs> do you want to take, take a photo of that quickly, please? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. The one time. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, well, let's ruin that now. Next question. Yes. Next question. Bring it Here on. We go. Who won the first FIFA Women's World? Was it Norway, USA, Sweden, or Germany? Who won the first? FIFA Women's World Cup. Was it Norway? Was it USA? Was it Sweden? Or was it Germany? Could be any of them. Who was it? Those are our seven answers. Two Anybody else? We got eight in the uh, We've got seven. Should have skipped through. It was USA. Uh, no, it might have been USA. Um, Bugger. Was the obvious answer? It was the obvious answer. But was it too obvious? No. It wasn't. It was the USA. Five got that, that right. Five, not quite. Reed Champ, top of the table now. Top of the tree with James Amar and Justin just in behind. Okay, Pete, you're not top of the table anymore, I'm afraid, mate. No, uh, didn't last long. On to question number four. This is tough. Who's got the most number of yellow cards this season with 10? Is it Calvert-Lewin, Ben Mee, Jorginho, or Ducure? Who's got the most number of yellow cards this season with 10? I know this one. God, oh. good night. I am very impressed. Very Smash impressed. It. it is indeed Jorginho with five. Of course it is. Reed oh, Champ. Man, we, we all oh. must have got that right. Yeah, very good. Very good. All five of you are there. James Amar, correct streak with three answers in a row. Need to make these harder. Ah, JP Robinson. I see what he's done there. He feels like yeah. a On to um, America. Yeah. Here we go. No, it's not. Oh. oh, no, it's done there. What happened? Fucked it. it again. This fuck this. Sorry, lang sorry for my language. Um, it's it's the software's not that great, is it? Um, 
Interesting. So hold on. So can you see that can on we the screen? Yeah, it's come up no. as hockey. And it's... But my, my on my phone, it hasn't updated at all. Okay. So maybe when you go to the next question, it'll be okay again. We'll, we'll try. We'll just miss a well, question. Try again, Bake. See what happens on the next question. Oh, it's okay. Okay. So I'm going to board called Hacked O. Oh, what? Okay. Well, this is Hello, all good Les. information. Who? Oh, Whoever's doing that shit. I see. Right. Let's get on to the next question. Let's see if it fixes it. <laughs> well, uh, well, that's better, but... Here we go. This is working now. Who are the current NBA champions? I'm going to go for my favourite name. LA Lakers. Is it the Chicago Bulls? Is it the Toronto Raptors or Utah Jazz? Who are the current NBA? Oh, 33 answers. <laughs> oh, man. So rubbish. Okay, well, we're going to have to quit it now, aren't we? It's just going to have to end this one. I don't understand what's even... Or we can just carry on. Yeah. But this doesn't make... Well, we might as well get through the last four answers, if it's the last okay, four of the yeah, quiz. Yeah. It's a shame, though. The software's not good enough. Yeah, there's a way to get through it. You can have a, like, two-step entry. Can you? Okay. Bloody hell. I supposed to um, get rid of it. I just didn't think it was going to be a problem. No, How many absolutely. times in his career did Sergei Bubka break the pole vault world record? 15, 25, 35, or 45 times. Uh, looks like we're back up to seven answers now, so that's good. Yeah. How many times is it... in his career did Sergei Bubka break the pole vault world record? But it's not finishing. Uh, uh, I mean, uh, fuckers. Excuse my language. The odds were 35. Well done. Yeah. That was... Well, we don't know how many. Let's have a look. Let's see if the... we're going to get weird names coming on the scoreboard soon. No. Jakey Robbins. Okay. Right. Oh, oh, shame. What a shame. It's, it's... Yeah, we're carrying on. We're carrying on. Yeah, we're carrying on. Question yeah, there's only two questions. Yeah. Three questions. Which team were originally Three. founded? Uh, oh. Sorry. Okay. I can't control myself. Sorry, guys. Uh, we'll have a go. Well, maybe we'll try with a different software or something next time. Um, yeah. Uh, oh, that one's got it, well. That's got it wrong. No, I'm just oh, going to shame. Yeah, what a shame. Guys, thank, every, thank you, everyone, for watching. Uh, really shame it had to end like that because the quiz software isn't quite up to standard. Um, it's weird though because we did one the other night and it was absolutely fine Paul wasn't it so um, we'll have a look into it uh, see if we can um, change it slightly so we can make it better um, but yeah thanks, thanks very much for doing this anyway it was, it was no good worries, fun mate, no worries despite I mean, the we, last uh, we got of... various options when it comes to uh, delivering quizzes online to be fair I mean oh, we could do it on. worst case we could do it manually and people can can take their own scores like you would in a pub quiz. Yeah, we can, we can there would be a lot of about, trust. The good thing about this Kahoot thing, uh, I, someone's telling us that they're hacking it now. He's saying, exit, I'm, I'm hacking it. Oh, well, funny. Okay, right. So we need to maybe make them private. I don't know. Can you make them private? Um, or we can make the video I private or something, maybe. Um, I, don't, I don't know whether it's coming in, whether it's through YouTube or whether it's through Kahoot. I think it's through Kahoot. I was reading something with one of the different options that you could. Um, could um, make it harder to hack by there being a two-step login process to the to each round, so you can. Switch off. Yeah, so the hackers the hackers actually saying it spams bots, so it's obviously an issue. Um, so what's how does this, sorry, what the hacker? The, if, the hackers yeah, in the comments tell, if, tell if, if you're a, if you're a hacker, why don't you do something else? No, but <laughs> the point is, he's actually telling us. So I, I you know, at least he's he's. That's slightly helpful. Bakes, how does it work with a two-step encryption? How does that work? I've no idea, mate. I've never tried yeah, it. Yeah, I don't know if we need to talk it's about it now. What we'll do is, guys, thank you for playing. We had yeah. – um, so JP won the first round. Uh, Reedy won the third round. Uh, who won the second round? Oh, no, I can't remember. Can't remember. Um, but, yeah, think, thanks. Um, James Amar won the second round, didn't he? James Amar won in the second round, yeah. So um, – yeah, anyway, so uh, we'll have a look at how to improve it for next time. But thank you all 
for joining us and um we'll yeah, see no you next time no children allowed <laughs> yeah cheers guys thank you very much see ya thanks bakes thanks pete yeah thank you all Peace for playing then. take it easy guys